Hey everybody, we're back. If you're new, thanks for joining us. I'm Shannon. Click that subscribe button, please. And if you're not new, thanks for coming back. Today we went to TJ Maxx. It was really random. We were at the outlet center and I had to wait for the stores to open because of the election. And I happened to see somebody walk by with a TJ Maxx bag. So I asked her where the TJ Maxx was and it was all the way at the opposite end where I have never been. We went, luckily I had my camera with me and y'all, we found some really great stuff. I found some NARS that I had not seen in any other TJ Maxx. I just, I found some really great stuff. So I'll let y'all check it out and I will catch you at the end. So Beauty Concepts has a lot of eyeshadow palettes we haven't seen before. This is the Horizons palette. This is going to be $6.99. And then we have um, rosy pink and gold nudes. I like that this TJ Maxx has the shadows covered. This is also going to be $6.99. And then we have, um, I don't know, 24 eyeshadow collection here. And it is a nude palette as well but this is also $6.99. Okay, y'all, we have some iHeart Revolution palettes. This is the Red Velvet for $5.99. We also have the Pizza palette for $5.99, and we have the Chocolate Cherry Bar. This is $5.99 also. They are sealed closed, so I'm not gonna open them and show you. We have the Kevin Aqua palette. We've seen this a few times for $19.99. This is a new TJ Maxx, so I'm seeing some new things that we don't normally see. Sugar Freak, this is $5.99 and this is what she looks like. And then we also have a Beauty Concept Sweet Tooth Chocolate Eyeshadow. This is what she looks like, sorry about the glare. And we also have a Sweet Treat Golden Chocolate Eyeshadow Palette and that is what this one looks like. This is going to be $5.99 as well. They feel kind of cheap, but um, the, the shades are really nice. We do have the Coastal Sense Revealed 3 here. If anybody is a BoxyCharm person, you will remember getting that years ago. They have the Lorac Pro. Let's see how much this one costs. This is $3.99. They have the Lorac Pro at this location. And we have a Laura Mercy palette for $7.99. This is the Fine Art eyeshadow palette. This eyeshadow palette is broken, but this is what she looks like. Very pretty. Okay, we have a Coastal Sense Revealed Smoky palette also for $3.99. And we have the So Hot, Hot and Spicy iHeart Revolution here. This is $5.99. We have Pop Beauty Setting 101. Oh, it's not in a box. It's supposed to be in a box. I don't know the price, but that is her. Uh, she's broken. And then we have a JCat Beauty Unicorn Magic palette for $3.99. We have the Marc Jacobs Duo here. This is a liner in the shade Earthquake and Purple Rain. We've seen this before. This is going to be $10.99. They have the Wonder Brow here, Brow Liner and Gel for $3.99 in Brunette, Black Brown, and that looks like all the shades they have for that. We have some Elf Baked Eyeshadows here in the shade Peach Please for $1.99. We have the Physician's Formula Quad we've seen before for $2.99, very pretty. And we also have some CoverGirl highlighters. This is in the shade Vitalist Healthy Glow. I don't know if that's the shade or that's just what it's called. But this is going to be $2.99 for this one. Okay, y'all, I just found this Stila Happy Hour palette for $19.99. Y'all, look at her. Beautiful. This, I mean, the quality, this feels really hefty, the packaging. I, Y'all know I want to swatch it. I'm not going to, but I want to so bad. They have the same Kevin Aqua palette we've seen a few times for $24.99. Um, they have a few of those Stila palettes, and then they have this Anastasia Beverly Hills $29.99. This is a mini matte lip set. We have the Kevin Aqua Gel Pop um, Gloss set here. This is going to be $12.99 for this set. And then we also have um, the face and eye palette, which we've seen before, for $19.99. Randomly back here, they do have one naked cherry still left for $9.99. They also have the Anastasia Moon palette back here still for $12.99. And then the Becca palette that we always see is still here. And that is still $19.99. Okay, y'all, we have a new Anastasia shade we have not 
not seen this shade before in the gloss. $6.99 and this is in the shade Grape Jelly. Actually really, really pretty. And then I super scored here. So I found a little NARS duo. This is the Afterglow Lip Balm Duo Orgasm and Hidden Pleasure. This is going to be $9.99. I'm actually going to buy this. Okay, and this is what these look like. This shade on this side is going to be Orgasm. The other shade is going to be Hidden Whatever. But we'll swatch them when we get home. Okay, all we have the Buxom glosses that we have seen before. This is the shade Kyla. And then we have Nancy here, Leah, Patricia, and Shannon again, which we have seen that shade before. We have a NARS Soft Velvet Pressed Powder here for $14.99. This is in the shade Valley. We still have Cover FX Foundation for $9.99. We have some Stila Shimmer and Glow for $6.99. It looks like we have a Lorac Lipstick here. This is Alter Ego Satin Lip, and this is in the shade Urban Artist. These are gonna be $3.99. We do have a Naked Skin Concealer here. This is in a darker shade. This is extra deep these are gonna be $6.99 we have the bare mineral set that we've seen this before and this is gonna be $14.99 I don't think we've seen this before this is the Josie Moran Argan daily moisturizer FPF 47 and this is $5.99 they have a few of them here we still have the Becca concealers for $5.99 and the Becca foundations for $9.99. We've got some NARS here. This is, oh, this is the duo stick for $9.99. And we've got Lorac here. Oh, we've got some Lorac um, Perfection foundation. And this is going to be $7.99. We do have some milk makeup here. This is the foundation stick. I bought one of these and I really, really like it. This is going to be $9.99. We have more bare minerals over here. We see these foundations a lot. These are $9.99 still. We have some Laura Mercier illuminating face powder. This is going to be $14.99. We've got Stila. Uh, this is going to be a highlighter for $7.99. We've got ooh, a bronzer in Fox Tan for $9.99 from Bare Minerals. And then I'm really tempted to buy this this time. The Joy Highlighter for $9.99. And we also have their loose foundations over here for $7.99. Okay, we have a Dr. Jart Christmas set here. This is going to be $29. We've got some more Murad. Y'all know I I love Murad so much. This is new to me. This is $24. We've seen this one before. This is still $19.99. We've got some Kate Somerville here. Oh, we saw this before. I remember seeing the um, Hydration Warrior. This is $39. Then we have a Face and Glow set from Kate over here. This one's going to be $39 also. Oh, we have an Overnight Lotion from Kate. And this is going to be $19.99 and $49.99 for this anti-aging um, liquid lift. 
cream. We still have that cold cream from Kate. This is going to be $11.99 still. And Pericone MD, I've never heard of this, but this is an essential starter collection for $60. I don't know. Maybe this is really good. We also have this Dr. Jart set back here for $9.99, Mission Clear. It comes with a cleansing soap, toner, moisturizer, and something else. I don't know what's in this one. Okay, y'all, let me know what you think. I feel like we had a good TJ Maxx day, especially considering we were not expecting to even go to TJ Maxx. I'm really glad that we found the NARS, and I was surprised that we found some of the other palettes that we found because I have not seen them in TJ Maxx's that I've been to, and I go to TJ Maxx frequently because I constantly am doing these videos. Also, I just want to mention, if you are not subscribed to our older channel, which we've had for a while, head over there, subscribe to that channel. We do Shop With Me videos. Every Tuesday, you can check them out. They are always TJ Maxx videos. Um, I will link it below, but let's go ahead and get into what I did buy. So, like I said, I did buy the NARS Lip Balm, and I just want to say that this was a great, great find for me. This one is a duo, the Afterglow Lip Balm Duo Orgasm and Hidden Gem. And I have them right here. They're super, super cute. They're little minis, so they're not full size, but this one was $9.99. And the reason I was so excited to find these little lip balms is because on our other channel, I did a Sephora VIB haul, and I actually purchased this, and it is a four pack of NARS lip balms. It comes with one full size and three minis that are the exact same size, and one of them is actually orange but this cost $40 for four where this cost $10 for two but let's go ahead and get into what these shades look like so this one here is the hidden gem this is what she looks like and I'm actually going to return this one I'm and I mentioned that in the video because I just feel like for $40 I'm not really down to spend $40 for the lip balms because I don't feel like these will last me that long there's a good bit of product in it for it to be um you know mini this is the orgasm shade but I really like the elf lip balms and they're significantly cheaper so I am going to return this but I'm happy that I found this little duo because I do love NARS and I do like these shades and and the problem that I think with this one is also that this comes with the Laguna bronzer shade and my lips are naturally dark so I don't really want a brown lip balm also really quickly the um, lip gloss because I'm not wearing lipstick today the lip gloss of the day is this and you can also find this one at TJ Maxx I think it's $7.99 this is in the shade Belize this was in um, a previous video I will link that video below also because they had a lot a lot a lot of um, NARS lip glosses and shades we have not seen before but that's on the other channel but I'll link it below and then the other thing that I grabbed today was the Anastasia lip gloss. This was in the grape jelly. I had mentioned in the video that we have not seen this shade before. This was $6.99. This is a very pretty purple type of shade. Let's swatch it really quickly. 
I feel like these are definitely more pigmented than the NARS lip glosses. I'll swatch the Belize that I have on right now. This is at TJ Maxx, so you can find this, and you can find it in a number of different shades, but I just feel like there's clearly a lot more pigmentation to the Anastasia ones. Then I also picked up this. I have not purchased anything from this brand before, so I was kind of intrigued by it, but the other ones had a plastic sticker on it, so you could not open them, and I couldn't show you. This one does not, though. And what I liked about this TJ Maxx is that a lot of the palettes that I did show you, they had a plastic cover that you could not take off, because if you didn't see the last video, I had a slight rant about... Um, people swatching the stuff in front of me but this is $5.99 they had a bunch of them this is what it looks like a little red velvet chocolate thing I'm probably gonna give this to the girls for Christmas just because I feel like they like the the food concept oh wow really pretty really really pretty palette let's swatch a few and see how they um perform I feel like this I feel like we just need to swatch this bright pink right here. This is beetroot. That is what she looks like. And then um, I will swatch a, oh, let's, y'all know I am a fan of gold shimmers. So let's swatch the gold shimmer. And this is brown sugar, which I feel like she could have been named better. The pigmentation is pretty good on this. For, you know, $5, $6, I feel like, this was a good find, and it's good for the girls for Christmas. I think, they'll, I think they'll get a lot of enjoyment out of this. I actually have a lot of stuff for them for Christmas already. If you haven't seen, I have already started my Christmas decorating, and there is um, some Christmas Shop With Me videos coming, so be ready for those. That's all the stuff that I got at this TJ Maxx. I was not, well, I didn't get this at TJ Maxx, but this is all of the stuff that I got at TJ Maxx. I feel like the pigmentation here, you know what, let's just try this on really quickly so that that we can see how pigmented this is. Y'all, the pigmentation is there. Oh, wow. I am, I am surprised at, I am surprised at how, how much pigmentation is in this gloss. Wow. What do you think? I like it. It definitely doesn't look natural, but, <laughs> but I like it. I think it's pretty. I think this is really pretty, and for $7, I'm definitely going to pick up some more Anastasia glosses just because I am pleasantly surprised and pretty happy with the pigmentation we have here. Also, um, this was from a TJ Maxx, or it might have been a Marshalls, but um, it was only a couple dollars. It's the Too Faced um, Blinded by Light Highlighter. Very pretty. I'll swatch it because we're here. Why not? I, this was in a video that I did also. I don't remember which one or I'd, I'd link it below. But if you can find this one, I've been reaching for this a lot. It's super, super pretty. Anyway, that's all of the stuff we got. If you haven't already, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, share, click the bell, and all those good things.